Hi, today I'm going to be making a mask with things that we already have at home. So, so this is a sock and I'm going to cut just a little bit off of the edge of the sock so that we have a hole right here. And then I'm going to do the same on this side so we can get rid of this. I'm going to cut starting right here. I'm gonna cut it off. Okay. Now that we have it with holes like that, now I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm now I'm gonna take snips on both sides, about maybe a little less than halfway to the middle. And I'll do the same on this side. Now I'll fold it so that you can see the snips are a hole like this. And if you see that it's not enough, you can just fold it back and cut a little bit more. Okay. Let me unfold it again. Now you have a paper. This is about half of a normal kitchen towel, a kitchen paper towel. This will act as your filter. So I'm gonna fold this half. I'm gonna fold it half again so that it'll, it will fit inside my sock. All I have to do is just stick it through here and pull it out through the other side. Once it's inside, once it is inside, I can just unfold it so that it'll fill the entire thing so it covers your mouth and your nose. Now, you just take these two edges and these two hole pieces, you cover it, put it across your ears. This is your homemade mask with, with things that you have at home. Let's see how effective this mask really is. So I put the mask on like that. And see, we ha here we have a fire lighter. And remember, don't do this without your parents' help. So I turn it on, and I blow as hard as I can. The fire did not shake, therefore, the filter is properly working. And remember, never use old or used socks. Always use clean and new socks. Thank you for watching.